Good morning y'all and welcome back to another vlog. I first off just wanted to say Ramadan Mubarak to you guys all. As I'm filming this video, it is currently the first day of Ramadan, which is really exciting. Alhamdulillah. You won't be seeing this vlog probably till like a few days later or maybe a week. I don't think a week, probably like four or five days later. I will be uploading daily content for you guys on YouTube for this month of Ramadan, inshallah. Um, that is my plan and I'm going to try my best too, but I don't want to like 100% promise that, more like 99% for the daily uploads for this month. But as you can tell, my bed is not made behind me. We got back from Cancun um, yesterday, like in the afternoon, and today is just going to be like a cleaning day, unpacking, that kind of stuff. But yeah, first thing I want to do is my laundry. I do want to wash my sheets. I was going to wash them before I left, but I was like, I might as well wash them when we come back. So. That's what I'm going to do and then I also am going to unpack and do that as like my second load of laundry. So before I start cleaning, I wanted to share with you guys um, the podcasts I listen to on Spotify, which I'm pretty sure you guys all know about Gollum Podcasts, but they literally have the best podcasts ever. Like they have so many different like series that you can choose from. I really love the Purification of the Heart series. I actually did not finish it. I was listening to it and then I kind of like stopped listening to it in the middle. So I want to continue on with that one. I think I ended off on like episode like, so I, I watched part 14. I think I'm on part 15. No, no, I feel like I've listened to these. I don't know, I'll just start at part 15. I might have listened to it, but it doesn't hurt to like hear it again, you know? But I just wanted to share with you guys the podcast I'm listening to. If you guys are looking for a podcast to listen to during Ramadan. Yeah, like even when it's not Ramadan, we should try our best to like listen to podcasts and etc. But I just wanted to share that with you guys if you were in the search of a good podcast. But I'm pretty sure you guys all know about this one. But just in case, you know, I thought I would share it. So yeah, I'm gonna turn this on and start cleaning. <laughs> While I wait for the clothes to wash, I'm going to finally unpack the suitcase. Um, I got my laundry basket over here to just throw some clothes in. I already have uh, like some dirty things I took out. These towels I wanted to wash, so I just threw them in there. I will wash those pretty soon um, along with the rest of these clothes. I feel like I don't know if I need to wash like every single thing. I'm just going to touch you guys down more in my suitcase, but we'll see. I do feel like I should wash this because I did wear it in the water. I let it dry, um, but I didn't like wash it and I feel like it should be washed. It doesn't smell like chlorine. The pool in the resort we stayed at didn't really have like a strong chlorine smell at all and my clothes don't smell like chlorine at all. So I'm like, did they even use chlorine? <laughs> um, but yeah, like for example, like this dress, I feel like it's clean. I barely wore it. So many of you guys were asking me where this is from when I posted a TikTok with it and it's from Shein from last year. The one bad thing about it is it is sheer and the quality is not the best on it but I wore like a slip under so it wouldn't be see-through and all that good stuff but it's not like the best quality dress. I just really like the print of it and it gets like super summery vibes. I will definitely be wearing this again and I really love the way it looked with the green hijab. Shout out to Furry for telling me to wear it like that. Definitely need to wash these. I need to take out my bags. Um, we'll wash this because I wore that to the airport. These I feel like are not dirty. I feel like these are clean. I didn't really wear these much. I think I wore them for like an hour and then I changed because I brought so many outfits with me and I just wanted to wear them all. I just like kept changing, you know? This is clean. Like the things I feel like I barely wore for that long. Like I just wore it for dinner. That was probably like an hour and a half, two hours. And then, you know, I changed into a different outfit after. <laughs> So that is one suitcase emptied out. Now for Farid's suitcase. I feel like most of his stuff is clean. Oh, these are my shoes. 
I'll put them back where they go. Kind of just gonna like smell his shirts to see if they're clean or not. <laughs> like I literally, yeah, I don't know how else to tell. I'm scared the shirt will leak like color. It smells fine though. Uniqlo has some really nice men's clothes if anyone is looking for like their husbands or anything like that. Like the shirt was from Uniqlo. They just had like nice like linen-y kind of shirts and stuff like that. Um, I don't know, just thought I'd mention that. <laughs> Uniqlo has like um, good things for like hijabis too. I got these pants from there also. I didn't bring them with me um, to the vacation. They're in my closet. But they have some nice like clothes, like modest wear, I feel like. If you're looking for some modest wear, try out Uniqlo. <laughs> Time to put away this pile of clothes down here. So it's like pretty late now, almost time for a thar. It is four minutes till the thar fruit said he's gonna shower really quick to freshen up and uh, we have like no food in this house for the most part because we haven't gone grocery shopping since we got back from our <laughs> little vacation. So I'm just making do with what I have. I got the dates on a plate so far. I had some um, bread and stuff and then I had some salon that I had put in the freezer. So I took that out of the freezer. I have this apple, I'm gonna cut it up, see if it's good. And I have some grapes, but I don't know if they're good. We'll see. This is not gonna be a good first uh, Ramadan meal for Farid, sadly. Um, my fault. I should have gone to the store. Let's cut up this apple. Are you freaking kidding me? Can't use that, no. Oh, yeah, a lot. Look, my wife learned how to make cauliflower. <laughs> Say that louder one. and clear. What'd you no, say? The second part, you're gonna get a camera. Say or give me one. I'm just gonna know how to cook. <laughs> <laughs> say it louder. Another wife. Say it louder. I know how to cook cauliflower. <laughs> this is all you get for you. Uh, I wonder if they can hear you. You mumbled it on purpose. All right, the fast has been broken. Um, it's been like an hour since then. I changed my clothes. We like need to go to two the hours. Two hours, not one hour, sorry. But me and Fred need to go to the store because we don't really have any food in this house. We need groceries, so we're gonna go to the store. I'm exhausted, but I didn't even do anything today. And um, <laughs> I think Fareed wants to cut his own hair, so he'll give you guys a little tutorial barber Fareed in the house <laughs> coming at you i'm gonna give him the camera he'll give you guys a little tutorial on how he cuts his hair but he never cuts his hair so i don't know what caused the sudden i'm gonna go cut my hair real quick before we go to the store so i look fresh for the store <laughs> that's literally what he said <laughs> direct quoted from him y'all Fareed was not playing he was being serious he got the whole setup <laughs> You do your thing. Come out. <laughs> Alright, we got one on the side. <laughs> I don't know why she's recording me for this. She needs some entertainment, she said. Uh oh, that's me show it. <laughs> take your time, take your time. And comment below if I should give Free the haircut next. <laughs> I'll probably make him bald, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, blend this in. One side. I don't know if it's even. How does the back look? I can't see it. <laughs> Can you tell me? <laughs> so I think I, I went a little higher on this side. Here, you can see the back. 
right now. Is that working? Hold it right here. Yeah. Uh oh. Perfect. So now we're gonna blend it in with the five because I don't know what she did with the three. She lost some of my pieces. Out of me? Three. I never touched the your five. five. <laughs> Excuse okay, me. So I'm gonna blend it. I'm gonna have to go with the five now. Anyone else? Um, husband, just blame them if anything ever goes wrong or goes missing, even though you never touched that thing. Sheesh. <laughs> <laughs> I have the ear brush. Oh, nice. Here, let me do it for you. Look, go down. Yep. Hold it. Hold this. Freaking ear to shoulder. Go down here. <laughs> okay, back to the bottom. I'm going to clean up a little bit. I need to go back to the one. I messed up a little bit here. Trying to smooth it out a little bit. I don't know if you guys can charge my camera for a bit. Yes. Now we're at Walmart. Gotta get some stuff. Don't even didn't make a list. We'll see what we need. <laughs> for it's fresh cut. You feeling fresh? <laughs> yup. <laughs> we forgot we a, cart a cart like always. <laughs> you forgot a cart. Now we have Me? Movie. You. You always trying to blame me, man. Always. <laughs> Not this time. <laughs> I already know. I feel bad because they're watching this while they're fasting. I'm over here eating fries in front of them. Let me just stop. So what if they watch it at night? True. Comment down below when you watch the vlogs <laughs> in the morning or at night. I'm pretty sure they watch it in the day. Here, let me like hide and eat this fry. <laughs> Afraid it's a bad influence, like I've said a million times. She wanted a fish plate. I think 2023 will be the year that we become healthy people. You've been saying that. <laughs> it's all about balance. Ramadan. <laughs> you can be on healthy Ramadan, huh? It's okay. No. You're not eating all day. You're gonna burn the calories. It's not about the calories. About the healthy, <laughs> the quality of the food you're eating. True, but eat it all the good and the bad. On that note, <laughs> we're gonna end today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you enjoyed Freed's segment of him cutting his hair. If you don't ever want to see that again, just let me know. And I won't. <laughs> Maybe I don't. don't. Know you put it. <laughs> don't comment that, he'll be offended. <laughs> Not really. No mistake in here. No sensitivity. <laughs> Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs up, let's go.